I think for me, it's Mother's Day. It's still probably my toughest day. Mm -hmm. um, I couldn't celebrate Mother's Day with my own mother for four or five years. Um, now I'm past that, and I try to celebrate that I'm a mom. Whether he's here or not, I'm still a mom. Learning to forgive myself that I didn't have to be the perfect mom. I'm not a perfect mom. Mm -hmm. And getting past that, the guilt that you place upon yourself, when you reach that point that, okay, I didn't make this decision, he did. When you get past that point, I think that's when you begin to really heal. Mm -hmm. And I was, I was mad at God. I walked mm -hmm. away from my faith probably for a year, and I'm yeah. glad that God doesn't walk away from us. Right, right. But, um, my faith has grown now because of the loss of my son. Mm -hmm. I see it's God's will for me to be out here doing this and helping others and, you know, starting other programs to help other people in prevention, mm -hmm. helping other people who are survivors like we are. And I have to give my glory to God for that because I was so lost, mm -hmm. so lost. I remember one thing that probably has stuck in my mind was the first out of darkness walk I went to. Mm -hmm. I was so shocked that there were other people like me out there. I Wait, could so, not believe it. So when you're not alone, you find out you I wasn't alone. alone. I think you need to ask why until you don't need to ask it anymore. Until you, you find peace within yourself that it's a, I'll never know. Mm -hmm. And you just are satisfied with that. But I think it's important to keep asking why. Yes. So there's, there's an element of, uh, and, you know, and this is probably really hard, is acceptance. Mm-hmm. So yes. at some point you have to kind of accept yeah. the reality of it. And life does go on. And how your life is going to be different from here on out. And, mm -hmm. you know. You know, one thing, we've not had a family picture taken since my son took his life. And it's because I feel like we're not complete. Sure. And it's, that's probably something that's been on my mind that I need to have done. But I just. Not ready for that yet. Can't do that yet. Yep. Not complete. Mm-hmm. Your life is the most valued thing in the world, mm -hmm. but I don't know what he was thinking, and I don't know what he was going through, so whatever he was dealing with was obviously bigger than life. I would really like to encourage people that if they've gone through the loss of a loved one, co-worker, um, friend, don't be afraid to reach out. Even if you are in elementary and you just feel really, really lonely, mm -hmm. it, it's okay to call someone right. because there are people that do care. You have to understand it's okay to not be okay. Mm -hmm. We're all not okay. Mm -hmm.